Big shit, big shit, big shit. It's a unique hustle, nigga. Big shit, big shit, big shit, big shit. Name another podcast like this. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECO, and I'm here with the lovely, amazing, official Miss Jamaica. What's going on? Not nothing, you know, my dad walk on. Man, you know what, man? I woke up this morning, so I'm blessed, man. Yes, sir. But you know what, man? We got we got a special guest in here today, y'all, man. She don't really need an introduction, man. You, if you watch TV, you know I go. <laughs> if you uh listen to music. If you want to be an actress and you were trying to watch somebody, she'd be the one to watch. Miss Nikki Natural in the building. Woo! What, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for the like. <laughs> so how you doing? I, Woo! Okay. <laughs> I am. You in Texas? <laughs> yes. Man, do you come to Texas a lot? No. This Why is my not? second time in Texas. Man, it's dope. Dallas? Dallas is my first time. Really? Yes. Man, hey, man. Let me tell you something. You got to go and get you something to eat. What do you like to eat? Seafood. What you think? You? She, she just came from eating seafood from what I heard. I did. Florida hmm. style seafood. It was amazing. Well, hell, we she's came from do Florida Jacksonville. style. Yes, yeah, she's from Jacksonville. She have a place out there in Carrollton. Oh, she yes, do? it's amazing. Really? How did you find out about that spot? Because my assistant, and my hairstylist, <laughs> my right hand man, my road manager, she's from Duval Hair Therapy by Dairy. She's behind me. Um, hey. And the owner of Florida Style Seafood is from Duval. Oh, okay. Jacksonville. That's dope, man. Yes. So, Nikki Natural, man, we want to we wanna really, like, we tell her what we do. Don't we go back? We like to go How back. How far back? As far back as you can remember. Way back. Way back. So we want to <laughs> know about you. We want to know, like, like who you were before you got into everything. And I know you a lot, you know, the TV and all that. We want to know you. What about... All what? the ups and downs. I mean, just everything. I think I heard you say that your granny was a candy lady. Yeah. Yeah, like we want to go back to them days. You know what I'm saying? First 48. Yeah. Poke <laughs> Bean Project. Exactly. Hey, yeah, that's right. If you right. watch First 48... Poke Bean Projects. I don't think they, they air them no more, though. Okay, no. Nah, it, it got too bad over yeah, there, or did. they shut it down. They been rebuilding over there, so. Mm. But, yeah, my grandma. Was it really that bad? Yeah. It was bad, and I was forced, because I love my granny so much, and I, I wanted to spend so much time with her, so I was forced to go over there every weekend. Oh, it was so scary. Mm. But it was so fun. The hood is fun. <laughs> the hood is fun. So she was a uh, candy lady, and her name was Rose, and they would call her Nosy Rosie. Mm -hmm. She was so nosy. Goddamn nosy. I got to say, God, <laughs> she was goddamn nosy, Rosie. So anybody, anytime someone would get killed, murdered, yeah, murdered, they would, Nosy Rosie, there's a dead body down there on 62nd. Come on, Nikki. Get on Larry Nick. Let's go. Oh, my God. She missed her call, and she should have been investigating. Yes. Really? So that's what I went to school for. Oh, really? Crime scene investigation. Was it because of your environment and the things you yes. saw? Yes. The reason why? I grew up liking it, seeing dead bodies. You you grew up liking seeing dead bodies. That's yes. the first time I've heard that. The guts and all of the stomach swelling. Okay, all okay, okay, okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. So I you, liked it. So you went to but school But it was for no, that. no money. Into no it. money? No. And you liked that money? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So she she couldn't stay? No. So you like horror movies too, don't yes. you? I love them. Really? I yes. can't watch you them. Are what? It's nah, not I'm real. I'm too scary, man. No. I, it, make, it look real to me. <laughs> so, I have nightmares. For real? It's not real. Man, you got to be kidding me. I can't do it, bro. I ain't even trying to hear that. You mm -hmm. going with that. My, my sister, uh -uh. she can't. She be like this. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Like, girl, what you is that going like, help? <laughs> what's yes. the next one? Yeah. Right. Uh, J. Crew. J. Crew yeah. says the same thing. Like, I they love, love it. I, I, love I it. can't do it, man. I was too soft hearted growing up. I was that child. I remember the first time I saw a wreck where, <laughs> I promise you, this was back home in Jamaica. It was at roundabout. You know how roundabouts can get dangerous, right? Yes. So, anyway, the person wrecked, ended up in a wall. I ran over there. All Everybody ran over there to see if they could help. Ran over there was an old couple and they were just laid they out. They were dead. I don't know if they were dead, but they were just laid out where you could see blood and everything. 
I, their brains? No. Stomach? No. Intestines? Please, no. Liver? <laughs> kidneys? No. Nothing? Oh. What the hell? Oh, she's like, she's like, she's disappointed. <laughs> she won't all see I everything. Saw, I do. All I saw was blood, and I ran off crying because oh. I felt like, because I didn't want... I was hoping that they didn't. They weren't dead. I was hoping because they're older couple. Well, you like, wouldn't know. You didn't stay to see. No, I couldn't. I, and that's when I realized I couldn't be a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> I realized you, at that point. By you saying you was hoping they weren't dead, it brought me back to my real old. It's old. I'm that's not cool. like I'm not this person no more. No, that's cool. No, <laughs> no. Y'all no, say no. I want to go back. Right? Man, I got yeah, stories yeah, with yeah. that. Okay, don't judge stories. me. I say I got stories that'll match your story and worse. Yeah, yeah, I don't know about that. So I promise you. Okay, so <laughs> when I was younger, <laughs> <laughs> I used to like, okay, when I would, would watch the news and it would be like, oh, somebody in critical condition or, you know, they got hit or something or shot. You know, like, oh, and I, I used to get mad that they didn't die. Wow. Yeah. That's kind of. No, I used to leave them laying weird, on the ground. Huh? I get it. No, but I, no I, I didn't get it. So I, I'm going to clean it up. I'm, I'm a, <laughs> yeah, because I'm still waiting. I'm like, I think this is why I, I I wish they would die because I think heaven is a better place for them. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. okay. Like so you, now like you like Jesus. Like like yeah. yeah. Now she's just going to put them in heaven. Yeah, I have clean myself. <laughs> you just going to put them in heaven. Now she God. <laughs> <laughs> heaven is a better place. That's a good cleanup, right? <laughs> I can't contest it. You know, clean up woman. The clean up woman. So, so I, all right. I yeah. just when when I think about you know being is it, 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 in the projects, there had to be some dope boys in the projects. See, the projects got dope boys. They got all kind of things going on. Yeah. And uh, I know you being uh, did you grow up? How old was you when you left the projects? Um, I always around even. I never left. <laughs> you never left. So you, no. you, when you see the dope boy, you like, oh, right. that's such and such. Okay, mm -hmm. yeah, he gets it in. He popping. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? <laughs> and they would give me money for my grades because I was a straight A student. So they would give me like fifty dollars per A, twenty five dollars. How did B. that make you feel? Rich. <laughs> so that, did that drive you to make more A's? Of course. And, and my grandmother also because I used to sell candy with her on the weekends, and we were we were popping like shop was jumping. So we would make like five hundred a weekend, and she would give me a hundred dollars out yeah, of it. Yeah, so imagine in the elementary school with a hundred dollars. Yeah, you bred it up. Bred it up, mm. uh, and ain't nothing wrong with it. Re what it is when you you um, re up? Yeah, re -up. yeah, you I used always to re up. Had to re -up. At the, at the so did you stuff. go get the candy and then go back to school and reinvest? <laughs> yes, I remember my teacher. She caught me selling candy. She was like, Hayden. "Oh, give me all this candy." I'm like, "Just take the money. It's early." She nah. hating. I just thought Sally take the money. Yeah. Wow. Like, I'd have been like, if you take all this candy, let me tally it up. This is how much you owe. Right. Yeah. She took my candy and she would give it. Uh, she was giving it away to kids for doing good in okay. class. <laughs> I'm like, why right, she gonna die real soon? <laughs> <laughs> but but straight A student. Mm. I like that. Straight A. Like what was your? What did you graduate like when you graduated high school? Cum laude. Yeah. Mm. And what was your best class that you loved the most? Math. I used to do math competition, math bowls. And who was your favorite teacher? Because you know, it's always a certain teacher. Miss Garner. See, I knew Miss Garner pretty. was a damn. <laughs> she was biased, <laughs> giving a grade. I don't uh -uh. like. Yeah, you didn't have to she work hard for Miss Garner. She, she loved hard. No, you. you she was hard. Pet. Yeah, I already know. No, She's trying to play us. I was so quiet. Like, the teachers barely knew me. They barely you knew were I was quiet in class. Growing up? I'm still quiet. But quick to the dead body. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm super quiet. <laughs> quick, but, but, but quick I was to the always, dead bodies. But let's get on boss talk. Because I, <laughs> <laughs> I was it. always a boss. And that's mm -hmm. dope. Even from fifth, sixth grade. So let me tell y'all a quick boss story. Oh, boss. Really? You knew it. That I like the way you said it. This one I knew I was a boss. Already. I love boss. that. Get boss. to it. Okay. So everybody wanted to hang around me. So the girls, I just, if you was bossy enough, you can hang around me. So this is how they proved to me they were boss. I would hold fights after school, but down the road from school, not on school property. They will have to fight guys, the boys. And if they beat the boy, they can hang around me. Nuh-uh. Man, you dope. I like that. So let me tell you. And so how old were you at this time? Sixth grade, probably like 11, 12. Wow. So this is how I got caught one day. So one of the, of course, the little boys got beat real bad by 
this big girl. <laughs> <laughs> so his mom came to the school, da da da. Talk about they jumped them, but they didn't. It was one girl. One girl. Mom. <laughs> so um, the security. They followed us one day to see what was going on after school. Mm -hmm. They put me back on the golf cart. They they finally caught me, and they drew, they rolled me back to the school. So I went to the principal office. She was like, "Oh, okay. Let me pull up your grades. You're on my principal order roll. <laughs> yeah, yeah." She's like, "Well, what? Why are you doing it?" I said, "I did it off your school ground. I should not be here." You told her that. Yes, because. That's true. I'm not on your school property. School is over. And what she said? Where did she home. Say? What are you doing? Why am I here? This is kidnap. And what she say? <laughs> she was like, "No, you still. It's still a part of school because we we both attended the school. So, but she was That's like, a lie. right? <laughs> but she was like, but I said, you know what? I'm smart because it won't affect my grades. My teacher can't lower my grades. Right. Mm -mm. Did she your grandma like, had to come up there? My mom, mama? no, no, no. We settled it. I told her I wouldn't. I wouldn't do it no more. Boss, you're right. You yeah, <laughs> but you did. Nah, nah, nah. No. I stopped. She, I she stopped changed, she I changed it up. She switched I it up. Bad. I had enough girls. I recruited enough girls. <laughs> <laughs> so to be over in that neighborhood that long, you you definitely that was a that had to be experience in the projects mm -hmm. on life. Like, but what I couldn't understand about that because in your interview you were saying that um, when you stayed with your mom, that was a total different environment where. With your mom compared to with your grandma. Mm -hmm. So your mom was raised with her mom, so she knew that environment and what it was like. So why would she let you still go down there? Why wouldn't... My mom wasn't raised with her mom. Oh, she wasn't? My, my, my grandmother gave her away to her godmother, so my mom godmother raised her oh. in a nicer neighborhood. So she didn't really... She so she's she a little softy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell us. Oh, she gonna hear it. She definitely gonna hear it. She ain't gonna hear it. <laughs> she, she, she. She don't watch if nothing. If she don't see it, she ain't hearing it. Oh, she ain't even into it like that. <laughs> she be watching my stories. Oh, why did you post that? Oh, you throwing gang signs up. I'm like, no, I'm not. That's just a peace sign. Talking Man. about. <laughs> you, 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 you something else. <laughs> Do you have brothers and sisters, or you're the only yes, one? Yes, I'm the middle baby. All you're girls. My mom, three girls. So and I got brothers on my dad's side. Were any of them also with grandma at that time too, or was it just you? Yeah, my oldest sister. She was over there a lot, and my my younger sister. Her dad was Haitian, mm -hmm. so she would be in Little Haiti. This part of Miami called Little Haiti. Mm -hmm. I've heard Shout of that out part. to my Zos. She was over there in the mm. trenches. No, my little sister, a thug, thug. Like, she was kind of rough I, over yeah, there. The, that area is really bad, too. <laughs> I is. heard about it. It is. Are Man, we, um, are you ready for me to go on into the music, or you want me to go into her business on love and hip-hop, or what do you want me to do? I, I, ahead, the first thing I want to do is bring up my, my partner, the mm -hmm. dude that I rock with, the bird man. That my nigga right there. Like, I love that cat, man. I love the way he represents the South, and I know already you had dealings with him. Let's talk about that a little bit. That's dope for me. And that's something a lot of people can't talk about, huh? <laughs> <laughs> only one. Only one. Only right. one. Uh, uh, Dereez Deshaun talked about it a little bit because I, I interviewed a, him. I just did a song with Dereez. Really? That's my guy right there. Last I interviewed week. him. Really? Last week. I interviewed him in when ATL. When is he coming out? Hopefully soon. That's we just did it last week. He's on a hook. And he like, love boss talk, so you in good okay, company. Okay, Yeah. <laughs> but no, uh, so just tell me, because I had him I, I against the wall on that then. Mm -hmm. I love Birdman, my dog, man. He gave a story. I don't play about Birdman. You can't talk to me about Birdman. I'm a boss. I understand right. bosses are the bosses. I'm not going to play with you about yeah. that. So just give me a spill on how you guys connected I in that whole thing. Way. For sure, for sure. <laughs> But, okay, so this guy um, was trying to manage me. It's crazy. His his company name was Boss Life. Hey, mm. that boy there, Boss Life. That's oh, all right. She, <laughs> your song name was Boss. Uh, what was your song name? Million. You had a boss. Boss? Boss song. Yeah, you did. I wrote oh, that down. Oh, what song? Hold on. That's the name look. of my um, mixtape. That's it. Girl Boss. That's it. <laughs> that was so mm. it. I, so but, yeah. I, I was going to mention that too, but let's talk okay. about Birdman. Okay, but Boss Life. <laughs> boss Life. Yeah, okay. But he took me to Birdman or whatever. So I had no music. I never like recorded or nothing. He was like, "Yeah, I got this artist. Um, never signed with him, but I was his artist, whatever." So um, I got this artist. I wanna, I wanna bring over here, and he was like, "Oh, let me, let me hear some." Oh, she ain't got no music right now, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> took me to the studio. I was like, so Bird was like, "She ain't got no music." What? Right. I was like, "Wait, hold on." So I intervened. I said, "This is a studio, right?" 
Let me let me in the boot then. Right. He was like, okay, I, I like, I'll fuck up. with that. Right. Yeah. Right. So I was like, I ain't got no music, but just give me some some time, and I can get you some music. Give me this. I need to be in here. This is the top studio in Miami, Hit Factory. Yeah. He was like, Did he let you in? Yes, he did. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Kick that okay. door in real fast. So you I did your thing. I did my thing, and I got a song with him in Bur in um Juvenile. Hey. And I got another song what? with Juvenile too. For real. Unreleased, exclusive. Why is it not released? Yeah, you got it? Say. Oh, he, got they got it. it. I got it. You just ain't releasing it we yet. Just, we didn't really. They never released it, but I, I got it. I can release it. Oh, I can, really? I can so just why? leak it. <laughs> leak it. <laughs> if you need it, that's one in the I chamber. Mean, right. In case, in case I need it. Legendary. Yeah, I don't legends. play. I don't play. Those I got some in my bag Stop if I need it. Mm. I work with legends. Definitely. Rich. Bitch, rich girl, <laughs> rich gang, rich girl, right? So he was like, you know what? I fuck with you. You a boss. You a gangster. Yeah. He already knew I was gangster. Yeah. <laughs> well, anyway, so yeah. <laughs> so he was like, um, I'm gonna tell you, cause I fuck with you. I ain't gonna never sign you. Mm. That what he said? Yeah. You didn't say like why? You didn't ask. It me. hurt my heart. Okay, so I was like. Okay, what he gonna say after that? I'm like, really? He was like, yeah, I would never sign you because I would never sign a female artist after Nicki Minaj. I said, okay, I can respect that. Mm. Put some respect on that, mm. on Nicki Minaj name. Mm. Wow. Erica Banks. Hey, we, hey, we, no, I was gonna go to, that, that, wait a minute, we there, so I'm gonna stop you right there. I'm pumping the brakes. How you feel about that? That is, yeah, we got, the, uh, you in Dallas too, and you like Dallas, right? Love Dallas. Thank so you. So far, I just got Thank here. You. I can't. But at least From you love so it. So far, I'm I'm moving here next week. Man, you here? I'm gonna buy a house. I got money. Ooh, so, shit, fuck it. boss. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. So, um, put some How respect on Nicki Minaj. So, right? so yeah. Right. When you seen her say that on, it, on when she said that on, I cut it off. I didn't even listen no more. You were done. Oh. That was, it was at first. You was I riding was, with it. I was like, listen, like, cause I was honestly, I was like, I cause I I felt how Erica felt. I felt like she was like having to prove herself coming under from Megan, you know, right. from the same label as Megan. I'm like, dang. And me, I felt like a lot of people was um, comparing me to Trina. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And like me coming from Trina, like coming from the same place as Trina, it was like, girl, you'll never get to that level. And yeah. I felt like Erica was in the same position as me. So I, I was like, I fuck with Erica. Yeah. But she's still going and like, but then she went again. <laughs> Nicki went nah. That no, was, you, that you was can't that do was that. you can't do that. I mean, you you able to speak your mind, but certain sh it's got to make sense. That shit didn't make sense. Bro, it just it, didn't make sense. And I I I don't I'm not the type that kiss ass to be like, oh no, don't talk about that. No, no. no. Cause like I said, like it be like a lot of people like to dumb themselves down when a certain person work walk in the room. Like if Beyonce come in here, they'll be like, oh. Like, of course, I'm going to still be like, yes, Beyonce, I want to take pictures. I want to love on her. Yeah. But I'm not going to be like, oh, I ain't nothing compared to her. I'm, nah, I would never no. do that. You Nobody. understand? So I respect her voice and her, how she feel. But it just it just didn't make sense what she was saying. It's, it didn't make no it's sense. It's early in the game. Right. Very early in the yeah, game. Yeah, it's too early. There's a man. lot of work to be done. It's a lot of work. Let me tell you something about Nicki, man. You don't play with that that singing, that them, them cadences, the lyrics, the yeah. way she get around different Style, bars. Everything. Ain't nobody. It's crazy. Period. In right. the game to me. Mm -hmm. Nobody. No woman. No female. And most niggas can right. mess with that girl. Especially when Stop Cardi, playing with that not girl. Not even Cardi? No. She can't mess with her. Not lyrically. Hell no. Especially when you have guys. I, I she feel can like rap, bro. When guys listen to a female, she that's can rap. you in a whole nother lane. Another lane. You know, right. you don't hear too many men like, oh, you heard that new listen, Cardi? Listen, man. But right. Nikki, they listen to Nikki. Nikki is men, lyrically a beast. Yeah, they listen period. to Nikki. Yeah, they listen I li to Nikki. Anytime. I don't play about that. I, yeah. I, I listen to lyrics. Yeah. And I know Birdman was he you know this boy he don't he don't get enough credit the the way that right. he laid that foundation yeah, he niggas laid don't it. really realize what's going on but me being an entrepreneur nigga, I see what's going on <laughs> now, you know I what I'm it. saying I saw it first and I respect it and now just to be in a room with him certain days when even when I wasn't recording he'll have me up there and just sitting in the room and it was just a like damn I'm really here with Birdman <laughs> and I never was even a type to be like. <laughs> like I would just take pictures of like of course the studio but I never grabbed the camera and be like yeah B what's good I, I just it just wasn't in me cause I just 
it just that's just whack to me. Right. Like well, you right. play though. You, know you gotta say you a boss, right. man. We ain't playing no uh, games. Cause I feel like I'm in here because I'm in here. Yeah, I don't need to be in here. I need to prove. Yeah, I'm in here. I don't need to do that. That's when the fakeness coming when you gotta prove. Yeah, I'm in here with Burberry. Y'all don't believe me? Look, look. But I think. But just going back to Erica a little bit, I could see how that would touch you the wrong way, being that you've been so knitted into that camp. Right. Right. So I get it. You know what I'm saying? Is there like ulterior motives to why she did this? I what don't do know, you, you know. These days, you never, you never know. You never know. What I mean? But I, I do under because we talking, right? It's a conversation right now, right? And mm-hmm. that's what this generation. And I'm a hustler, is. so I'm this looking. This generation is more like, yeah, we are gonna get them talking. Whatever we gotta do, we are gonna get them talking. But exactly. I'm not on that generation. No, no, no. You gonna I'm, work? I'm cool you gonna with put that. that work in? I've been putting it in. So you ain't gotta worry about it. I've been putting it. You in. gonna feel your pressure. <gasps> The energy is right. Right now, I'm putting it right right now. Already. <laughs> oh, boss, yeah. talk, oh, boss talk one on one. Why the bosses talk? But the bo- the most bosses is that a word? Bosses. Yeah, straight up a word. Bosses. Yeah, let's Bosses. go. It's, it's a Which word. Which one is it? It's your word. Bosses. Word let's go. Bosses. Bosses. Let's go. <laughs> Thing that Birdman said to me was, when you get in there, cause you gonna get in. Don't fuck these niggas. That's the dopest thing he could have told you. Mm. He said That's one thing about Nikki, she, you never heard. Oh. She fucking the op. She fucking this nigga. She, you never heard no shit like that about Nikki. She never she was the one games. like just around here just fucking all type of niggas. He like, don't fuck him. He ain't got to. So I was like, he ain't got to tell me that, but okay. And you know what made him really respect me? I showed him my DM of unread all these ain't even blue checks. To these niggas. Yeah. niggas. Yeah. yeah, yeah. NBA, NFL, yeah. rap niggas. Everybody. Nobody. Unread. I ain't even going to say nobody name because I just never been a type. I got some names. You'll be like... You ain't talk to him. I'm like, nah, because I already know what it is. Like, like when niggas, I got a song called Round Trip, right? Okay. Let me bring some more boss. Talks let's go, let's here. go, let's go. I it's like this. Round Trip. You know how girls, they be want to get flued out. Word mm-hmm. to the city girls, Carisha flued out. Dudes, all they always in my DM, like, I want to get to know you. Let me fly you out. I'm like, nah, nigga, let me fly you out if I want to. Mm. Boss. You don't know me. I'm Boss. not going to fly out somewhere out on, to the unknown. Exactly. If you really want to get to know me, fly to me. For and if sure. I really want to get to know you, I will fly you, nigga. Ooh. Round trip, too. Y'all better take notes. Right. Relax y'all and take do, notes. be giving these one ways. Yeah. Nah, we, I'm going to give you a round trip, too. Because if I'm I'm sick of your ass, I'm, I'm sending you back. Well, I sure agree with Birdman. That nigga know what he talking about. That nigga, <laughs> nah, he you do. up in here. Yeah, he here. Do. Yeah, for <laughs> the real. The conversation real. Yeah. And that's what I like, you mm-hmm. know. And we done interviewed a bunch of people, but baby, you bringing that pain and that pressure hard that's right That's why now. they were trying to stop me. <laughs> Can't let her in. They're going to love her. They're going to love her. Don't let that bitch in. Man. Bitch, I'm here. What the fuck you talking about? And that way. So, you know, <laughs> <laughs> the thing about you that sticks out to me is when I looked at... Uh, Love and hip hop, uh, I trick daddy. Mm-hmm. How, how did you and him link? Like, how did you end up? What type of how did that relationship thing go? Let's talk about it. I want to hear that from on Boss Talk 101. What a boss is told. <laughs> I ain't even got no gun, but I'm chewing. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so trick, aka Maurice. I like to call him Maurice. I'm okay, sorry. okay, I'm a little more personal, you know. Maurice. Maurice is very special. You got to, that's one of those persons you have to handle with care. Yeah, He yeah, don't yeah. really mean it, but he mean it. You know? Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> don't let it get to you. He don't mean it, but he mean it. But don't let it. It's trick, daddy. Yeah. So, but Chaotic. He's okay. already on. Y'all heard of Chaotic? I've heard of Chaotic. Chaotic hooked me and Trick up. Yep. And I was like. But he, he only hooked y'all up so that you could get on the show. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I said it. <laughs> Like um yesterday on Tasha K's show. Yes, he did. But being around Maurice, aka Trick Daddy, mm-hmm. I actually l- really fell for him. He was a sweet heart. When you said fell, you mean fell that in nigga love? Nigga was cooking for no, that I nigga fall be in cooking. Love. Okay. Nah, we okay. wasn't in love. Did he cook okay. for you? He definitely. That's didn't. what it is. That nigga <laughs> was cooking. I he know that cooking. nigga be cooking. He was that- cooking, but he's a he take care of of a lot of people. Like yeah. he's a very genuine hood. The, like the grandma, but he a granddaddy. I mean, a, <laughs> he a daddy. <laughs> no, none of these kids got kids. Yeah, he ain't a granddaddy yet, but he's a daddy. But he's like the grandma of the hood. That's okay. his spirit. It's like wow. the grandma that's cooking for everybody and making sure. You know what I'm saying? That's how trick is. Do I cook? Yes, do you cook? Can you cook? Ma'am, back there. 
Say it real loud. Can I cook? Nope. Yeah. Oh. I get down, baby. My family is from Barbados, my grandfather. Wow. So I know island food. So you know I'm on that goat. <laughs> and then I still, yeah, you know. She, uh, <laughs> oh, that's why you married, huh? Man, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah one, of the, exactly. one, of the, one of the reasons. Right. One of the reasons. That's one one of the, the reasons. first reasons that right. she cooked for me immediately. Ooh. Oh, you knew what you wanted. You were like, <laughs> I don't know what the hell she put in that food 20 years ago. Yes. I'm still here. Right. That's why I be can't, I can't get rid of people. <laughs> no, for real, the food. Like, I love cooking. It's like one of my hobbies, too. Like, other than cooking, playing basketball, that, and being in the studio, those are my top three. Cooking, basketball, studio. Wow. Acting. So, when you, let's get back to Trick. Uh-oh. I want to know, like, like uh, how did you know, like, there was a spark there? Um, It was in the beginning until it was no courtmanship. He wasn't courting me. He just want to cook for me. I mean, that's a part of courting. Maybe but you it's don't like, know how to court like that. Mm. Come on, he shouldn't. He know no, how to court. No, you know, we old, nigga. You thinking <laughs> we court this way, court that way. It's not your way, but we courting. Maybe you need to take the But no, but I told, no, if I tell you what I want and you still don't do it, then it's not going to work. Mm-hmm. I get you it. You feel me? Yeah, sacrificing just is something little in relationships. Stuff. And I don't want much. He? How well, old is he? I don't know. Uh, it's, it's undisclosed, you know. I don't know either. I don't really know. I, <laughs> I never don't know. matter. It don't matter what age we mean. It don't. Nah. What's age? the oldest guy you eight. ever talked to? Um, eighty-five. Like thirty-eight. <laughs> I'm no, for real. Thirty-eight. <laughs> that ain't that old. Thirty-eight. That ain't that bad. Right. Thirty-eight. Okay, and but at the end of the day, I agree with you. Your age ain't nothing but a number. It's not. So it's, at the end I mean, of the it day, is. Wait, is it? As long as you're of age and you're not out here doing something right. crazy, that look crazy, yeah. then no. Nah, but yeah. he was a good guy, and he was very um, sanitary, very clean guy. Those were the important I used to spend to a night with Trick a lot, but we just never would do it, so that's what made him break up with me. Wow, you oh. weren't for to give it up. Only because... Bro, you don't be giving it up. That's why you heard, listen to Birdman too much. You're like, I ain't giving exactly. no nigga. Exactly. I'm not exactly. giving no nigga the industry this. No. You got to be a regular nigga to get it. <laughs> For real. <laughs> that way nobody don't know. Me. <laughs> Shoot. But I no, kind of like that. It, but That's it wasn't, real. It wasn't cause, because of that. It just, it was no... Clothes legs get fed. I like that. Ooh, you a beast, my nigga a beast right here, bro. When that nigga start asking for that cat, you move on to the next nigga just Ooh. like that. Mm, mm, mm. When he start asking for that cat, move on to the next nigga. There's too many niggas out here. I'm not going to be giving up the cat just because you horny. Especially me. I started having sex when I was in the third grade with a towel. Ooh, we Lisa man. No, Lisa, she real. honest. No, no, I'm that, honest. no. She butt naked out here with it. Like, no, no. There's too many people be hiding stuff. No, for See, real. I'm this serious. is real. That show that you done grow. You mature. I'm like very to mature. speak like that, right. to say that in front of everybody. Most <laughs> niggas is, is, and women don't. They don't tell stuff. They be hiding mm-hmm. it. You know what I'm and saying? And the reason why I brought that up is because I'm so used to having sex with that towel that when I when I do decide to have sex with a guy. That towel. I think about the towel. The, towel, about no. the towel better than the nigga. <laughs> because my body's so used to the towel now. So wow. it's hard for me to come from a guy. Damn. And I did it too you long. Know, because you know how to please yourself. What is the libido? What it is? The libido? libido? <laughs> the libido. The, 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 what is it? Man. Look it up. Y'all look it up. <laughs> it's something with an L. Libido. Libido? She talking about when, it, when she... Libya. Libya. Labia, no, not no, that. No, not that. Uh, no, it's the little bit. She got the word right. The area, you know, I said it right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's just off now. It just won't towel. <laughs> no, for real. You done, you done messed yourself a, up. I did. You I, messed yourself totally up. I honestly totally did. Up. A man can't do it for me, really. Just the towel. You know what you need? Sex therapy. I'll look into that. <laughs> they can help you change it. <laughs> but... That's how. <laughs> third yeah. grade. So I got my first nut in the third grade third from a grade. towel. And it was the best you ever had. It's the first. Do I you still had. got that towel? You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> How many other t- you got towels like it? Now people who know know that story, they be like, I ain't using no towels. Yeah, that's why I got some of y'all stealing them. You're going to be uh-huh. jealous of the towels when he come over. Mm-hmm. Huh? No, you in the bathroom, what them towels So at? that's why it's so easy for me 
not to be like, oh, I want to fuck. I'm, like, I'm mm-hmm. ready to get to my town. It's sad. It is sad. But I think it's because you you may meet meet a guy who who knows how to restrain himself as well and knows how to t- take care of himself and then y'all meet in love and 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 it's a happily ever after moment at that point. Let me liven this moment up. Though. It's sad. No, it ain't sad no more after this. I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> this nigga crazy. Okay, it's sad, but it made me a pleaser now. So you just like to please. Right. Damn so it, I'm boy. like, I like. You go in. I like. I ain't gonna say it. Now go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Here. He in the back. He gone in the back. <laughs> he know you wild. Yeah. I like this. Yeah. More yes. than anything. So you like to make him happy. Man, I like this. That's right. dope, bro. That is so dope. I'm the pro. So the pro. especially with the braces now. The bra- you would help me. That, you would think the braces would cut it up. Mm. No, now because now that I have the braces, the braces you cover your your lips. Okay. With the braces. Oh, we man. <laughs> man, and it's going down, <laughs> man. That, that's oh, beautiful. God. See okay. that this woman right here. This is a, this is a great interview. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This is what interviews. Are, this is the first one honest, I got to have. Like, just I love honest. your okay, honesty. Yeah, I love okay. your honesty too. That is dope, man. Right. Uh, I just want to be myself. It's hard to get back to the interview when you go there mentally. You got to try to bring <laughs> it, carry the one. I'm you sorry. Know what I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You got to carry the one. You know, go back to elementary and so all boss that. boss talk. Let's get back to it, man. <laughs> boss talk, man. Not what boss, boss talk. Boss man. talk. Man. So top three artists <laughs> no, of all time. Before you get into you that, my, because at the same time, I want to know, um, because you talk about not dating anybody in the industry or, you know, closing that off. Mm-hmm. Would you date a regular guy, nine to five guy? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what mm-hmm. you're looking for. Like mm-hmm. Somebody, mm-hmm. Yeah. I love them. <laughs> so, They're my men right there. Ooh. Yeah. I love so, me a nine to five. Oh, okay. That's what we call them, nine to five. They got my nine to five right now. Somebody that ain't gonna, you know, uh, right? Yeah. yeah, they don't know the That's people in the really industry sexy. for real. I love a nine to five because you see a lot of females in the industry. They're doing that now. They're dating somebody that's not totally really? in the industry. Yeah, like street cats, right? Really though, um, <laughs> street cats though. Huh? Nah, I like. I don't really like. I don't really go for the like the street. Yeah. No, nine to five. I'm gonna introduce you to my son. This nigga at the in the oil field now. Wait, yeah. <laughs> in the oil field here? working. Nah, he in oh. the oil field. He the one set you, he the one actually set up set you up to you be know, here. Oil field. He what works in mean? the oil field. Like he works with oil. Like Oh, yeah. he said oil. Yeah. I thought he said the off field. <laughs> <laughs> Turn him I'm country. I'm country. Oil field no, he in the oil, in the oil no. field. Okay, for no. real. This boy is. That's what yeah. he's money. Yeah, he's making a little money. money yeah. Single? yeah, he ain't got no kids or nothing. 28, yeah, he's chilling. Actually, <laughs> Trey. You know what? Trey? You know what? He set this up for you to be here. He's still on PR. Mm-hmm. He set everything up. Where he at? Where in, he not here? In, in West Texas, yeah. But guess yeah, what? That he, question it, that I just asked uh-huh. came from him. That was the Which only one? question. If you date a regular nine to five. Hey, that nigga slick. Why this nigga <laughs> slick as hell? That's my son with that foolishness. <laughs> he crazy. Put a good word. Are you serious? Y'all put a good word in for me, all right? <laughs> that's a damn shame. The only question I said, oh. you want to know anything else? He said, no, that's all I need to know. Oh, Lord, this nigga is crazy. That's all I need to know, too. <laughs> In his Instagram. Shout out to Trey, man. I'll give it to you for sure. He's something else. He, yeah, that's my guy. Though. Okay, yeah. that's your son, son. Yeah, hell yeah. So, um, daughter-in-law. Like a like that, nigga. Stop playing, man. You in the building, man. Mommy. We ain't playing no Mommy, game. Hey. Mommy, daddy. she is silly. <laughs> <laughs> You come get a Caribbean food anytime. Ooh. He comes get the oxtails. Oh, all he the do time. it. That's his favorite. I Let say, nigga, don't bring nobody oxtails. else over here. Trying to bring buy them and bring he them to the house. Oh, don't do that no and more. Bring to all his friends, <laughs> niggas. I don't and they like, expensive. And I be like, nigga, don't, do not send them up. folks. Yes, price went I know. Up. We, uh, I don't let them come to my house. So I meet them up here or I meet them somewhere. I be like, here, man, quit sending these folks. They want to just send, bring a pot up, uh-huh. bring us a pot, of, and then they take them somewhere else and eat them. My kind of niggas. Crazy. And then he don't eat cabbage from nobody else. Ooh. Yep. See, just. I need some of your food. <laughs> she your Sunday, it's right? Right. We got people. Sunday? Do, yeah. Matter of fact, yeah, she cooking Sunday. If I, I don't get that plate. Up here. Yep. Everybody you coming into Venom. You gotta come up here and bring the CSG and all them guys coming Sunday. So we. We, we we kicking it. Okay. <laughs> she's, she's like, <laughs> yeah, we we be feeding everybody. We got people coming. What time? What time? Two o'clock. We're gonna be at two. 
canceled. That's, like, yeah, we I'm here. Been. That's perfect time. Oh, we gonna be kicking. I got it. the all girl showcase, Texas Star. Oh list. man, we gonna be kicking it. That's all you got to do. Three, say, three stop to playing. Three o'clock. What time we start? Three? three? On Sunday? Texas Star List. Yes, okay. I'm performing. I'm speaking on a panel. Y'all need to come out. I'll come for so you. After let we me eat, eat. Let me tell you we something. We're going to Texas Here, Star here's List. Here's the whole game. <laughs> Usually, we don't go nowhere. She know that. Okay. But if you come on this show and you say, come here, I'm there. Okay. So All you right. ain't got to say nothing. As long nothing. as we don't have an interview. Yeah. What you mean? As long oh, as we somebody don't have an book. interview here. But at the end of the day, I'm coming anyway. Okay. So usually when they say three... She don't perform the five anyway. Okay. These niggas mm -hmm. is slick. Yeah. Uh, all right. <laughs> so I already know that. I'm coming. I'm going to come there. through for okay, sure. I'm pulling please, up. Please, because don't miss this show. Man, okay. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm coming. For I'm Dallas. coming. I'm going crazy for that. And Dallas. I don't like, unless you got to put me in VIP. I do not like standing in crowds. I'm too old for that, and I'm the, too player. You, you better fit. You get me area, set up. You know how I am. Area, you was with me in Miss VIP Hook, last time we Miss did Hook. something. Get me in the right <laughs> spot. Yeah. <laughs> We good. And we got whatever you. Whatever I got to do to get there, that's what I'm going to do. I don't care if you take my seat. Y'all got my seat. Nigga, I'm coming. Okay? I'm coming. Y'all can have my seat. I'm coming. After I eat them all sales, y'all can have my seat. I promise you're going to love them too because she gets down. Yeah. I already, I could, I already could tell. I know she gets down. I know. Down. I already know. And I go everywhere. New York, wherever <laughs> we at, we be out of New York, Florida, wherever. Yeah, and we go, I be like, hell no, nah, this else. still ain't it. Everywhere I go, I still can't find. That's how I feel. And it be dope. Like so. my grandfather, he the only one that made gold, the best gold. Like you my gold, I could Mutton. cook. But he killing my gold. <laughs> he killing my gold. I'm like, damn, I had to this. train them to eat gold because they would not they don't, eat gold. They eat gold. I'd be yeah. like, okay, they, no, that's mutton. In, in, that's mutton. in Jamaica, she, it, we was getting it off this resort. <laughs> and I said, yeah, give me a little bit of that. I did not know what it was. I like she it. was laughing yeah. afterwards. I, I ate it. She said, how'd you like it? I said, it was good. She say, <laughs> that's gold. That's gold. I said, I said mutton. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that's the <best. laughs> But I ain't stopped eating it since. Exactly. If you cook it right, right, uh, it's right. Everybody, be can't, everybody right. can't cook. Right. right. Yeah. Nope. We gotta get to love and hip hop though. I want to okay. understand because I was going to top three, but I go to love and hip hop. Like, how is that? Like, I had Solo Lucci on here, and I was <laughs> like, I be trying to figure out how they setting this up. How do they? You know what I mean? How do they lead up to the issues that be popping off? You know, is it? Give me the game. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people be thinking it's fake. It, I don't think but it's fake. I know it's not fake. From, especially well, from, what, from he what he said. said from yeah. what he said when he came on here. Like yeah. they place people or something. Mm -mm. It's not fake. It's not fake. I don't know about people in their households if they set up like, okay, we're going to do this. Maybe that could. But it's structured because what he said, let me tell you what he said. Okay. He was like, so if, say, you have an ex-boyfriend, but you're dating somebody else now, mm -hmm. you won't know that they reached out to your ex-boyfriend right. to date. That's that what he right. said. Right. They do that. And then they'll, you know? they'll, just, like, they'll show up. You know? Yeah, like, so, what you doing and here? And it causes problems, and that's where the fight and all mm -hmm. of that stuff start happening. Because so, that's what happened with me. They, they had to set me up <laughs> <laughs> with the fight. Yeah. Like, it was a big episode. Like, that was probably one of their biggest episodes on Love and Hip Hop. Which one? When they jumped me. Yeah, when, yeah. But then you tripped after that. I seen <laughs> after that. You crazy. No. But you supposed to go crazy I at that point. Like four, so five how women many, it was to four put, women jump you? It was like five of them. Did you, and, and, and I think you said. Your it was no, like, did you say Trina me. set it up? I felt like it, yeah. That's the way you acted? Yeah, because. How the how the recording is? They have like wherever we at, whatever destination we recording. They have cameras, of course, with the production and they're watching everything. She was in there while I was out there, oh. so you watching me get jumped. Then you gonna come out? What is happening? <laughs> bitch! I got and that's the only reason some. I call her a bitch is because I'm first of all I'm heated as fuck. I'm not gonna mm -hmm. be like, ma'am, I just got jumped. Do that sound no. right? No. You gonna be like, man, bitch! I just got drunk. Fuck you talking about what happened? Stop playing with me. You don't so fuck she, with me. And she and we, so she that's just, why me and her had our beef because I call her that bitch in that heated moment. Was she, you from the street? But she should right? understand. You should understand. Right. It wasn't no like real beef where I'm like fuck Trina. I run. It was none of no disrespect in that type of way. And I say this all the time. I actually like Trina. Mm -hmm. She's a very beautiful young lady, and I fucking love Trina like I used to go to school with her brother that passed away you know rest in peace gunky so it was like I'm like dang like this TV shit is real like y'all really let this shit just try to ruin somebody but when y'all can really be exactly. like nah I ain't even like that Nikki cool exactly. as fuck cause everybody know I'm cool as fuck Fuck. Because you know a lot of that reality shows and stuff like that messed up a lot of people's relationships, right. messed up a lot of people's lives, right. connections that networking that they could mm -hmm. have possibly had they can't have anymore because of it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But I want to, you know, Trina um, seemed like she wanted to scratch with you when that happened. 
Fight. It, it seemed like it seemed wait, like wait, which one at the reunion or at, the fight? No, at the fight. At, yeah, because I called her a bitch. Yeah, it was, it was, like, it was ah, like I'm like, what the hell going on here? Right. I mean, anybody when some, somebody calls you that fight word, bitch. And I you, ain't say bitch. I said bitch. <laughs> I said it real deep. So it was like, yeah, them fighting words. But she gotta respect me. Like we from Liberty City. We from the same hood. You know what the fuck time it is. Stop playing. Don't let this TV shit fool you. For real. So you in them streets like that. You come from the... She know where like, you come from. Right. So people are like, oh, I'm from the real... Like, we, no. we all from... I went to the same high school Trina went to. Wow. So it's not like I'm from the... Oh, the little suburbs. No, bitch. I'm from, I'm from the hood, too. Like, we but, know what it is. We know what the fuck... Don't try to play me for TV. That's how I... I just felt very disrespected on you really trying to make this bigger mm -hmm. than what it really is. It's not... There's no beef. Like, I really... F I fuck with Trina. But that shit, when she was like, you dirty, your kids dirty, you beneath me, and you fuck men for money. No, I don't. Birdman told me not to do that. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I listen, shit. And my son's father's very wealthy. I don't, I, ain't ha I don't have to have sex. I don't even fuck him. So why would I fuck any other man for money? Right. So it was just like, why, is you, why would you say all these lies? I never spread, spread it, no lie about you on TV. So that's what, when the disconnect from Trina was like, I can't fuck with you because you, that's some fake ass shit you just did. You just pulled on me on TV. Have y'all ever spoken again? Nope. And it was so crazy. We was in the green room and we was like um, recording our confessionals and she was there and my people, they, you know, they from the hood. So they went over there. It was like, they went over to her dressing room. It was like, you know, Nikki over there, she want to kind of, Chop it up. She was like, yo, yo, I, I don't got no problem with Nikki. Yo. We don't need, ain't nothing to really talk about. Like, she was like, hey, that's just TV. Like, she brushed it off. So I was like, oh, okay, cool, we good. Then we got to the reunion. It was like, ah, I'm like, what the fuck? That's bitch crazy. So it was that's like. That's what you call actress. Right. It was it's like, I, I, I couldn't. That's why the, everybody was like, why you just sat there? Nikki didn't really say nothing. I ain't need to say nothing. What what I'm going to say? No, like, like, I'm not going to go back and forth, give that. For I'm not cameras. going to give you that energy. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna sit there and just, you look a mess. And she was like, yeah, you look a mess. And it was more of a mess of a, like, you're supposed to be a role model to us women that's looking up to you. You're supposed to be, you know, women empowerment. What's going on? Like, right. that's why I was like, damn, that's fucked up. Like, I was fucking with you and Trick. But even Trick had kind of, like, jumped over there, too. Like, everybody was just, like, jumping on the Trina bear. Like, oh, fuck that bitch, fuck that. But that's why I called them the king and queen crabs. And I meant that because... You know, crabs in the, you know, the right. bucket. Right. Like, they were trying to pull mm -hmm. me down. Like, why, why y'all not building me up? Why y'all keep pulling me down? I ain't do shit to y'all. I ain't taking no food out y'all mouth. I ain't putting none of y'all down. And even in my interviews, I still big them up. Mm -hmm. They fucking represent Miami. You can't go to Miami without hearing Trick or Trina. When you from another, you know, state or something. It's Trick and Trina. You gonna hear about Trick and Trina. That's what you you going to Miami to see Trick and Trina. You going to Sunday's Trick Restaurant. You going to see Trina perform or whatever event she have. You going there for them. And I fucking respect that shit. But they disrespecting me a little bit. But it ain't stopping shit. Man, you know what, man? I'm rocking with you. You here with me. Facts. When you come rock with me, I'm rocking with you. Mm -hmm. I ain't lying to you either. I'm kind of weird. I'm thrown off. I'm old and said my damn ways. No, because you but understand I, the real I, shit. I, and I know, I know that for me, the younger generation is who carry the vision, the next, right. the next episode for me, because of what I believe in. I'm a believer, so mm -hmm. I know that the younger generation always has the vision. So I always rock with it because I know that change has to happen in order for us to grow as a people. Oh, I'm right. gone. Y'all, I don't know for y'all. Y'all wait. Right. And, my, so. I, and honestly, yeah, I, I, do, believe that. I do all this shit for inspiration yeah. for the younger generation. That's right. It was not, this shit ain't about no money. I drive a fucking 2021 AMG GLE 63 AMG Benz. Talk that I talk. live in fucking Buckhead where everybody trying talk to live. My talk. rent, like. My mortgage. Talk that mm. talk. I just sold my $850,000 house. Like, I'm looking for another house. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it's like, I do this shit to inspire. So let me break this. When I say inspire, I have my bachelor's degree in criminal justice. I see I'm a that. medical massage therapist. Mm -hmm. I have my child development associates. I have my dental aid certification when I graduated from high school. I'm a basketball coach. I play basketball. Um, I'm an actress. I'm a rapper. I fucking does this shit and it's not about the money. I don't 
I haven't punched the clock in over eight years. Mm. Big accomplishment. You understand? So it's not like, oh, I'm doing this because I want to I wanna be rich or, oh, I want to hang around the stars. I can hang around anybody the fuck I want. My son father run one of the top cl- fucking clubs in Atlanta so I could be around the stars. We got the bread. It ain't about that. I do this shit to inspire. I'm a mother. I fucking do this shit. I'm smart as fuck. I'm pretty as fuck. I'm a brown baby. Real talk. And I'm doing this shit for the inspiration to others and they everybody's still trying to tear me down when i'm trying to help y'all see that the worth your worth because a lot of people they don't understand they be like damn what makes me special i ain't i ain't got shit you make you special just being you because god only made one of you that's wow. it that's all that matters it's one of you and you could do what the fuck you want to do Trump was president, motherfucker. Do, hey, the, do, do man, the fuck you want to do. Playing. Stop playing. Out of all the accomplishments <laughs> you've ever accomplished, like if you if you just gave it all up tomorrow, what would be your crying achievement of, out of everything you've ever done? That one thing that you were most proud of? Hmm. See, I'm letting my mama see me walk across that stage, get my bachelor's. Dope. Like, cause you know, most like a lot of people in my family didn't go to college. That's it. So it was like, I'm probably like one of the first ones who graduated from college, and my mom get the brag to her sister, like, yeah, my baby can't. You know what I'm saying? So just she was crying. It was just like, oh my god. As long as I made my mama proud, I'm good now. Now I just do this shit for fun. Mm. All this shit is for fun, but at the same time, it's to inspire. It's really to inspire. I don't do this shit for the money or the fame. Inspire like, your boys m- mainly. Definitely my boys. They fucking love me. They're my biggest fucking fans. Do you want more? Do you want a girl? Fuck no. I got a stepdaughter. A couple of them. Let me talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, nah, I don't want no more kids. Mm-mm. You got a, a couple of things that's coming up, up and coming TV series, man. Let's, uh, let's talk about those. Yes. Um, so I'm on P Valley. Yeah, don't come for me. Oh, don't come for me. That's, oh, I don't know, up in the air. <laughs> <laughs> they ain't come for me, I don't know. They gave me the check, though, but I don't know. They kind of The got, money came? They gave me the money. They paid me good money, huh, Derry? Good and, money, and but they, they disappeared. Maybe. Maybe. At least you got paid. I got paid. Was Will in it? Who? Will Smith. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's, stuff getting cut off, you know? <laughs> he that's, might be owner or something, baby. Right, that's you know, fucked Things up. are getting cut off right now. You know? That's <laughs> fucked That, that oh, is fucked up. Damn. That would make sense, though. <laughs> but no. <laughs> no, nah, they, they ain't even checking. Uh, we ain't never filmed yet. As long as they ain't asked for the money back. They can't. <laughs> no, it's already <laughs> My done. My paperwork is... Yeah, yeah, the time was solicited. They, they, yeah, we already knew what was going on with yeah, that. Yeah, that, but... I, w- I the hope boys they do, got to eat. The boys got to eat. Yeah. But no matter when they ever went ready to, to I was still on You'll work with okay. it. Yeah, I still be like, nah, that was too long. I won't even do that. I still okay. fuck with them. That's, That's just the type of person I am. They'll just pay for my flights and rooms and mm-hmm. shit. But yeah, but um <laughs> Let's talk about P Valley then. P Valley. Second so, season. Growing up, everybody thought, I guess because I was fine, I don't know. They thought I was a stripper in Miami. Why? How, why would they think that? I, I mean, you, you know, I'm looking at you. I don't see how they. Co- I'm trying to figure out how they would even come up with something like that. I like I'm with know. you. Like I don't know. You don't look nothing like, um, like ginger. Yeah. What's some stripper names? No, no, got to be brown sugar. Um, uh, uh, uh look, Alexis. Look, wifey, like, oh, you oh, know that name? No, 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 we be kicking it. We ain't tripping. Yeah, you should see. She took me to a strip club in Jamaica. That was crazy. Three of them. Which Did one? You go? Which one? It's in Kingston, though. Three you of them in Kingston. You didn't get to go to Kingston. So, I know. I'm going with y'all. <laughs> <laughs> y'all giving me. I say y'all take me to Jamaica. Okay, what's next? No, so, family, because I am. So you went. So you went. Hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna link that up for show. Yeah. <laughs> but you went to the strip club in Jamaica, right? No. What was you didn't the name? To- they was trying to take me to one that they be having sex on a stage in Ocho Rios. What's the name? Oh, I know man. you know the name. It be going down. That, I cannot We didn't do name. nothing in Ocho Rios. You Wait. know, and I, I found out later that it was some more stuff that I should have seen that I was kept back from. Wait, did anybody ever there. tell you you look like somebody famous I don't want to hear it. You, I don't want to hear it. Oh, you know what I'm about to say? I don't want to hear all that. What show is that? You know what I'm saying? No. I'm trying to wait to see if you're going to say that don't exact say actor. It, don't say it. It is him. No. Damn. Don't even talk about stuff like that That's while we're doing an interview. Nothing? We're doing an interview oh, here. Okay. But, 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 if you can't remember that name, you know we're going to tell you the story. I, I don't even oh, want to hear okay. that. You don't want to don't do that. You know all what right. I'm saying? Because okay. this nigga got out, really got out of line one night. For real? Yeah, we've been everywhere. Y'all, y'all not related? No. Oh, okay. Hell no. <laughs> Let's get to it, man. Boss Talk 101 where the bosses talk. Let's go. 
Um, but P Valley. P Valley. Back to P Valley. So I was a stripper on there. Yep. Did you? Do you even know I do tricks? No. You was on there but looking I was the, real pretty. <laughs> you, were, you were a stripper in one of your songs, so. You right. should have known how to and do all them tricks. It manifested. That song manifested P Valley right. for me. Because I, I lied. I was like, yeah, y'all, catch me on P Valley. This was like two years ago. What was your name? On P Nikki no. Natural. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's what you went with. Yeah. And how did how did you do how did you do the dance? Did you <laughs> I was doing more lap dances. That's slow. You was doing the white girl wine. No. The white girl wine is just kind of like, you don't even have to do nothing. Just You just move slow. Like, <laughs> no, I was, I was getting out. She's she doing it. <laughs> yeah. what? For real, no, the it. white girl she's wine is just real exactly slow. Right. And, and, it, and you just kind of look oh, to the left she and to the, the yeah, just a little. You ain't got to do nothing. Get my money. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did a lot of that. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> but I, got I money. you, I got you money, said y'all. you didn't like the picking up the money off the floor part. I did That's why, no, I'm saying, as a, that's why, I, was, stripper, I would never yeah. be a stripper. You didn't, you, that, I, it just, I can't fuck with that. You germaphobic? No, no. it's just, just the degrading no. point of oh, picking okay. it up. I just, well, you know, yeah, some places just, they sweep it and I'm then they pick boss, it up for you. This boss talk right? What I'm if they boss for that? But what if they sweep it? No, and it's then the, they just be, the throwing. Oh, that's disrespectful. Don't throw no shit at me. Oh, and it'll hurt. Give my money in my hand. Dance, like, boom. I didn't do it like that. You know how dudes like to make movies? I'd be like, no, don't do that. The baby just give me my money. Just no, give me a stack. Just have a stack. Right. Just put a stack that. right there. Yeah. yeah. Stack right you done, right. you done right. thrown it before, so you know right. what, it's, like, what it's all going down. And it feels how good. I feel, that's right. Like, when you throwing it, you letting it go. It's fun as hell. I'll be at V-Live tonight. Hey. So, But it was fun. So when you come through V-Live, or whatever and people see you there they gonna they gonna come over there and yeah money going everywhere it's the first mm -hmm. is it not yet <laughs> <laughs> hold on ladies I got I need some men in the Dallas I can't be spending my own money hey Ooh. man they hear them they hear them what are you what show them to me don't make me make Send some phone calls you yeah, know I got a key to the me. city I ain't playing tell them come out with me alright I'm, I'm gonna make a few phone let's calls let's make a movie tonight in V-Live I'm gonna make a few phone calls come to make a movie with Nikki Hey, and, and I'm can throw all their money, and I'm single too. And look, I, and I ain't gonna do nothing but get a towel <laughs> 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 and some head. Hey, oh, that's oh. it, man. <laughs> Boy, that's what now that's a hell of a comeback. Like, you can't really, right, don't come, never, for me. don't come, don't come, come for look. Me. <laughs> told you I would clean it up. <laughs> <laughs> She's a clean and queen. So, yeah. so what, is, what, what do you like, like? Do you shop a lot? I, I gotta ask you that because you look nice. I mean, I'm looking at your toes and everything. What? What? How do you shop when you hit a city? You won't believe me. <laughs> I'm gonna say it. I don't care because I'm that bitch. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. I like to shop at Ross. That's your cousin right there. I knew I could see it on you. <laughs> my I could mom. see it on That's my you. Mommy. Yeah, this here. Be right in Ross. Boy, this is it. I hate <laughs> Rosses. We go every city. We can fly to yep. any town, and she gonna be like, "There no, go Ross." I'm like, to "What?" No, but there's a secret to it, though. Bro, y'all crazy. Let me hear. No, I want to no, hear this. No, no. Let me tell you, my I secret. hear this. When you go and you go <laughs> shop at Ross. If they have multiple of the same thing, I won't even touch that because I'm not going to be wearing the same thing. Right, right, right. But they'll have something that is just one Exclusive, of. huh? A two of. Yeah. No. And I'll go through though. and I'll find yeah. it. Yeah. It's, nah, Ross be having that shit. If you know how to put it Especially, together. Especially, you know, I got an Airbnb. Oh, I forgot. I got an Airbnb business. Oh, really? So I go there a lot to shop for my Airbnb. Yeah. You be kicking it. I get to it in. I'm a, I'm a hustler. But I, but I can tell <laughs> from, the, home too. from the things that she's saying. Oh, home, home goods? Yeah. Of Look course. At like, <laughs> yeah. Oh, he be over there too. Oh, hey, you too? Nigga ain't all in home. I'm Press, like, who is that nigga over there at the home Liano? goods store? Yes, that, nigga to be, that nigga supposed to be over there at the uh, <laughs> horse race or at the at the car track. This nigga, at, where you at? At home? Home goods. Oh, hell. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. You supposed to be at house. Home Depot, nigga, with me. <laughs> the Depot. <laughs> We call that the depot. <laughs> we'll be at the depot. Man. <laughs> no, but seriously, so I love me some Ross. But, you know, I, I put on a little designer every now and then. Yeah. So these shoes, splash. I know that was $1,500. See what like, I'm saying? A little know. splash. You know, so jumper probably, I got this on sale for like $10. I ain't going to lie. And the shoes, $1,500. So Ooh. it's like. It, it complement each other. Right. That's I don't it. have to do all that. I'm not doing all that. I ain't going broke. Shit. On no. clothes that you only gonna wear one time, right? You can't, That's especially when you post this. Like, oh, Nikki, you can't wear that no more. I'm wearing my shit. 
fuck you that like too. Tiffany Haddish. Shit. But you, you, you don't be worrying, Twine. Nigga, I can go on your page right now. You lying. Uh, yeah, yeah, you lying like hell. I do. I do. Really? You just gotta change it up. But men don't care. I got a lot of men followers. They yeah, don't care. They're not gonna be like, nigga, you wore that last no, week. No, nigga don't give a damn about they that. They don't care. <laughs> looking at stuff not like at all. That. Right to win, oh, child. Woman. She ain't got no money, but rich as fuck. <laughs> 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 so, yeah. so Ross and, and a Flying little bit of your nigga this. out, sis. Flying your nigga out. Ooh. So, <laughs> she gotta keep that money for that. Yeah, put it over there with that. I'm a little sugar mama a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I like, no, I wouldn't say that. I just like this. I like to spoil my man. Wow. Man. Yeah, she like, she like she said she likes like to please her man. I'm a too. pleaser, right. Please so that comes her. all with that. All I'm, a, I'm a massage therapist. When is your birthday? I'm a Pisces. Oh, okay. March now. Wow, j- just had a birthday. Happy belated birthday. Thank you. Kicked yes. it. Yes. Kicked so, it? what you do Jamaica, for your birthday? Jamaica, you oh, yeah, that's when she was in Jamaica. Okay. And I heard that um, somebody got in trouble in Jamaica. What happened over there? Mm hmm. What oh, happened in Jamaica? So it was your fault. Yeah. She looking at you like. I, she the, ruined my birthday. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what the hell she happened in Jamaica? She went to jail on my exact birthday. She went to jail or all y'all went to jail? No, I ain't go. I stayed and shook my ass on stage. Shouty. And I she went to jail. Something, I said, I'm going to do something in Jamaica. And you let her go to jail? With her, and I, I mean, no, my other friend went with her. But they ain't get locked up. <laughs> 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 they ain't get locked up. They just had to. What they what they call it in um overseas grass? There was grassing, there was snitches. <laughs> he was like the white man was like y'all grass, you grass. That means snitch overseas. Wow. Uh-uh. Mm-hmm. They just had to snitch on the white man. I had nothing to do with that. Mm-mm, I rap. I can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I ain't want that to be grass. No. <laughs> wow. Well, that's good. No, that they didn't mess up here. They, no, it was no, it was more of a self defense thing. This white man was putting Caucasian. I ain't gonna say white. <laughs> I be was white man. What's wrong her? with white man? Caucasian. What was he doing? He was, but he put his hands on her, so she had to go and, and he 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 ripped her five thousand um, dollar Christian Dior bag, and he had to pay for it. And yeah, and you so, didn't have no guys around you that like just like no, it was just all females. Well, uh, well, no, because like the reason why I ask you that because when, when you're in Jamaica and they see, <laughs> especially if there's guys around, oh, yeah, there were guys and around, they, they were see scared. they were scared. They huh? were scared. Everybody they was scared. 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 Yep. What place did you go? We went to the Bahia. Because yeah. normally, like where, where yeah. I normally, if, if a guy, it's a to, resort, so it's all people from out of guys town. Guys will jump in. You didn't no, have, oh, you I didn't ain't gonna have lie. the locals around. Right. That's and some of the problem. locals came after. They was like, where he at? I'm like, exactly. he gone already. They was like, damn. We were, they were like, we would have fucked him exactly. up. Exactly. If the locals yep. are around, they're not going to sit down and watch right. any the woman locals, being manhandled. Yeah. They was ready. That wouldn't They happened. was ready. I had picked up this ass traffic off. Fuck him up. But he, they ended up getting him. Take him to jail. But That's crazy. He was drunk. Yeah, he was he was drunk high. He was on something, but mm. they had to go down there, and so she could get her bag paid for it. That's a five thousand dollar bag. Hell yeah, motherfucker! How long did it take? They paid for it, right, then? Yeah, they paid for it. Really? Okay. Uh huh. He had to pay for it. Well, he, well, he went to jail, so and he went to jail. He had no business doing that. Yeah, he shouldn't mm. have put his hands on her. Nigga, crazy as hell. But I was not going down there because <laughs> it was my birthday and I wanted to shake my ass on stage. And I lifted up my dress and I had on a thong and I made and it clap. Did. I made it clap. And that's, <laughs> that's one of the songs on my CD, Boss Girl, Girl Boss. Did you get it's visuals while you down there? I had nobody to even get a visual because everybody was in jail. I had nobody to, no, they didn't even see me. Nobody got to see me shake my ass. Uh-huh. And, you still, and I don't dance. So that's why it was so funny to me that I did that. I'm like, fuck it. I'm doing some shit I, I'm not exactly. used to. Exactly. You're not at home. You're. <laughs> right. I'm like, fuck it. Like, do so something that you normally don't know. If them videos ever surface, because it was a lot of people that came out, I'm like, <laughs> oh my God. Maybe they don't know your name. I hope my so booty they was they lotion or something. I hope it was lotion. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he looking like wow. I made a clap. Boss girls, girl you boss. Kill, you <laughs> killed that. Yep. You 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 love. What made you name that? That girl boss. Yeah. I, Cause I told you from elementary, I've been a boss. So you just had to back it on up. Boss man, girl boss. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know where the name natural comes from because good question. You, Nikki natural. We know Nikki, right. but where's natural? So Nikki is actually my nickname. Mm-hmm. My real name, Naisha. I like you your like real Na- name. You like Naisha? I like Naisha. Oh. Naisha. 
Okay, so so Nikki, my mom was supposed to name me Nicole, mm -hmm. so she ended up naming me Nikki. Nikki. I mean, Naisha. Okay. So they was like, fuck it, we still name her her nickname Nikki. So I kept Nikki. But um, natural, a lot of people, they be like, natural, bitch. Nothing natural about you. I'm like, hmm. That's what you think that means? Is my name Nikki Natural Body? Or Nikki Natural Hair, Nikki Natural Eyes? Is that my name? Anybody in here? Anybody? Answer? Yes or no? Is my name, is Nikki Natural or Nikki Natural Body or Hair? Nikki natural, right? Nikki so natural. natural, when you look it up in a dictionary, the main, the main definition is innate gift. I'm gifted. I'm a natural at everything I do. That's mm. where that name come from. My, and my big sister gave me that name. She was like, you just good at everything, bitch. You a natural. Damn. I was like, Nikki natural. She was like, yeah, Nikki, you Nikki natural. That's, That's where I get dope, my, my name from, right. That's dope as hell. Uh-huh. Nikki Natural. Yep. So, Nikki Natural, you're going to give me the top three artists of all time, dead or alive. Mm. Any genre, too. Tupac. That's number Erica one. Erica Badu. I hope, I hope I you see her this Dallas? weekend. I might see her. That girl said er Erica Badu. Yes. I love Erica. What? But, yeah. That last one, man, it ain't no respect there. <laughs> I'm serious. The last one. I love me some Erica Badu though. Erica Badu, yeah, let's And we back. Pisces, and we got but a couple baby daddies. That's my girl. And she's so <laughs> genuine and just like that's me. That's Dallas. That's us out there. That's, that's Dallas. Dallas. See, for I'm real. Dallas. She rep Dallas to the fullest. <laughs> you will never hear her say anything, anything out the, out the way by Dallas, Texas. And I've been watching her, her whole career. Shout out to Jamie Foxx. He another one. He won't play with Terrell, Texas. Oh. It's right down the street mm -hmm. from here. That's dope. So it's like, and it's a small town. I met Jamie town. before. I, I, I you partied You should have told him, nigga. Nigga, I went to Terrell. Okay, we want to hear something. Oh, yeah. After the party, <laughs> party we want to hear about it. We was Who playing. else told us they was at? Solo. <laughs> Solo, Solo Lucci. Um, Who else? on Love. Everybody that done been on here had like, a Jamie story. So it was fun. About the, what happened there? We was playing there? cards. That's it. No, no nigga. No, 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 nigga. You had a towel. It was a no, towel somewhere in that damn place. It was in Atlanta. In Marietta. <laughs> it was it a towel somewhere in Atlanta. It was in Atlanta. He had a house in Atlanta. Everybody says that Jamie throws the best parties. The best parties. He had like anybody. a thousand um, wing stop wings. It was all, it was just wings everywhere. Rick, Ro and Rick Ross was there if it was wings. No. <laughs> Bow Wow was there, Lil Bow Wow. That oh, was really? my, that my first time meeting Lil Bow Wow. Uh-huh, I got the Look number. how, look how she looks. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I, get, I get the number. What did what, what did Lil Bow Wow say to you when you met him? He got mad. I don't really be, like, talking, but he had got mad one time because that night he he invited me to his house. I was like, uh-uh. Nigga want to get over there. Birdman told me. No. <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever tell any of them that? No, I don't say but I say it in my head. I got to remind myself. <laughs> I Bird can't give these no. niggas nothing. Told me no. He gets <laughs> nothing. These niggas get no. nothing. Out of, it's all of be these, a friend. out of all of these celebrity males, mm -hmm. is there any one of them you have a crush on? Did she say Erica Badu and Tupac and who else? Can I no, say nobody, else. nobody else? Drake. Nobody. All right. Drake. Uh, that was the last one. Uh huh. Okay. Cool. We got my three. Okay. Who I got a it crush can be, on? It can be men or women. Oh, woman. Or give me one male, one female that you have a crush on. Who is it? <laughs> um, that if they came up to you and tried to holler at you, it would be the hardest thing for you to even. Mm, that's hard. Drake. I thought that's who it was. <laughs> I thought that every woman. I, I would not. That nigga can't never be around me. I would never something. be around Drake. <laughs> this nigga heard. I done already heard that you can't be around Drake with no Why woman. Why Drake? Lee, he was here the other week, too. And I was called. They was like, Drake is here. I was like, damn, I must really be moving up when I get to know when Drake here. A nigga's calling. That nigga was what, here a couple of weeks ago. him? Other than him just being light-skinned. Yeah, I got you know that what? call. No, no. You know what? It's just Drake. He just so... Uh, I didn't get that call. I got the call. Yeah, it pulled through what Drake was. It came through rap a lot. You wasn't here that night. Well, it don't matter. You <laughs> I should have called you. He came a day early, too. Why Drake? Why Drake? Drake? I don't know. Drake is just... He cool. You know, like it's just like he don't try too hard to me. He just be chilling. I just like the Have chill. Have you met him in person? Never met Drake. Damn Drake. He just be chilling. I don't know. It's not even cause how famous he is. Cause he honestly, he's not the like my type. Like if you see the most of the guys I go, he's not like oh yeah, cause Drake that's her type. It's not even that. It's just he just be chilling. Mm. Whatever, man. <laughs> and what female? You know, I'm a real life hater. Fabulous. I'm a straight up hater. Yeah, I like fabulous. I, I, I can see why. Why you say that? I need your tr that truly something special. 
That's that's the one. So everybody fell for the nigga when that song came. I can't now really swag, explain though. it. I'm so that into is, you he now. He just swag out though. <laughs> you like them guys that are laid back. But I ain't gonna lie. I got another one. Hold on. I got to add one more. I went to see Nas. Oh. Are you serious? What? No. That nigga laid back, ain't he? See, you see, I she like that. what it is. That nigga ain't trying hard at like, all. Yeah, all of them see, like that fabulous. Nigga yeah. back. He be dressed, but fabulous still laid back too. They all just laid. Would you ever date Kanye? Hell yeah. He got Kanye, well, I'm too dark for Kanye. <laughs> well. No, but I'm just saying, if if I was lighter, if, if it was <laughs> possible, would you ever? Because we had a debate the other day. He's like. Every any female would date Kanye. No, I didn't just say it like that. Now, damn it, don't say it For like real? that. He did. I didn't say it but like that. that what I, I was I'm upset like, in the heat of the because moment of the because the, because of the kids and, and him not getting to see the kids. So I said some things that I kind of regret. Now. Okay, you know, but I was really upset because I don't like the way that the kids and him and them and them, I just don't like to see that. If because it's true what Amber Rose said about Kanye, he'll love me. Oh Lord, this is why that's weird. Yeah. No. That's all I'ma say. Damn. He would love you. He's Look at damn you. that nigga. Yep, he would. Well she said Next. something that was he liked it like that. Oh <laughs> Look at idea, he liked it like that. <laughs> he put the tight heels up right now. There's yeah, certain things true. you can't do. He'll love me. <laughs> yes. So that's fun. Now, <laughs> this is wild. So, <laughs> do you? Um, so you are a freak. Any? What you the are. hell? Where did this go? <laughs> no, because you know what? What y'all just said just brought up another thing that I heard in another interview. Uh uh-uh. uh About you? you bleaching something? Oh my booty hole. Mm hmm. Look how he looking. Look how he looking. This is going different than I expected. You know, this interview just went. Hey, what you guys realize? This time zone. Wow. What the hell is going on? Do y'all got any places out there that bleach booty holes? I've never heard that before. I heard it on a song. Kanye was the one that said said it. Kanye was the first one lyrically put that in a song that, yeah, and it made sense when he said it. I did not know people do that, honestly. Look at <laughs> now it's it's a wild world, you know. This world is changing fast. Um, you know, people are doing things out of the Sorry, norm. Mama. So they just out here looking for booty hole bleachers. Yep. You don't know nobody? I don't know nobody. I'm sorry. Is that a service that you can get? Definitely. You would probably have to go to that place where you'd be going to get the stuff. The bikini waxes. Yeah, and talk and to them first too. and lead on into it. I bleach my own my own booty hole. We'll talk, about that. we'll talk about that later over them oxtails. Okay. Oh, no. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Whoa, Nelly. Yeah, I'm, uh, a, I'm a natural. Like, I'm a natural. Straight up natural. <laughs> I do it the natural way. But you, did you, you, you said, did you say Tupac early? Yeah, yeah. I love Tupac. What, what's the, because I didn't get that story. What made you like Tupac? Because you young. You, you ain't got no damn business to listen to my Tupac. Ba- I ain't gonna lie my baby daddy. He blasted, he blast Tupac. What's your favorite song from Tupac? That, um. Keep your head up. Mm-mm. What? I actually, on my um, mixtape, I my favorite song, I sampled it. The, um, so much pressure. Well, that's really? one of my favorite right there, my nigga. That's it. Cause he talked to why he got on glasses. That's yeah, Shamari. that's Shamari's favorite. Yes. Yeah, for real. yeah, yeah. So my daughter, it, um, my sixteen-year-old. Okay, she I'm made straight A's too. I'm in the family. She's straight sure. A's. Nothing. Less. She made a hundred and eight of them. She loved she because loved. of her daddy. See. But it's I the one I it's called We Outside on the mixtape. Y'all gotta listen I to gotta it. I gotta listen to yes. it, man. I you I, I'm put to do that yeah. soon. So you did it justice. Mm-hmm. Yes. That's yeah, good. I did. Yeah. I just used a little bit. That's little that's bit of it. But that's my favorite song though. I wow. love my my auntie them used to play it all the time, like on repeat. I'm like, what the fuck is this? Mm. So but it it just I'm like, okay. It just I, it That's grew my on me. era right there. So I grew up listening to that one two. song of Tupac, and I fell in love with Tupac. He my number two. And once I saw Poet of Justice, I'm like, mm. I like Post Man. Boy, bad. <laughs> boy, bad. I used to love me some Tupac. Damn, right? Right? Damn. You know, I'm a, I'm a pimp C for that. So. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but that nigga was bad. That's with a bad that, nigga. No, that's the only man that could wear a nose ring around me. That nigga bad. Pimp and C was my favorite. Right. Of course, you know, I got to say pimp on every episode. Pimp R.I.P. Yeah, Pimp. Pimp. Pimp That's just all I do. I, I gotta say that every episode I say that. But at the end of the day, 
Um, yeah, it's real in the field. Um, <laughs> <laughs> boss, <laughs> boss. But, but so what do you expect from Dallas? What do you expect? I want Dallas to love on we me. We already doing oh, that, yes, nigga. Y'all are. Yes, y'all you know are. We better cook your oxtails. Hey, yes, yo. no. I just want Dallas to see Naisha. Okay. Not Nikki Natural from Love and Hip Hop. Because mm, no. it was such a... I, it was biased because some people are like, oh, fuck with you. You don't even take no shit. And then it's like, no, bitch. You need to bow down. So it was like, I got a lot of half and half. So mm. on my comments, it was a lot of hate, but it was a lot of love, too. You read the comments? Yeah, definitely. All I mean, of them. I ain't that busy. I'm busy. You but be I, sitting there reading them comments like, damn. I do that. It's like, fun. Damn. It's fun. Like, what that nigga say? And it don't get to me. It don't what? get to me. I was about to say, have you ever been hurt by a comment? In the beginning, when I first did TV, I was like, fuck this shit. I'm not that person. I was so sad. But then I'm like, man, fuck people. I don't care. I'm going to do what the fuck. So? Some of the stuff is outlandish, though. Those dope. haters are going to keep hard. coming back to but your cool. comments all I'm the cool time. Now. They, it be they fun watch now. I'll be you. like, mm, I'll be responding back. Oh. You be they talking like, back to them? Because, all right, like, for instance, I just got my braces back on like two weeks ago. I had braces on the whole show. And mm -hmm. that was like two years ago. So I had I ain't wear my retainers, guys. Yeah, so you had so, to get it back. <laughs> <laughs> so that was like, damn, she still got braces. They were talking shit because I was on um on Wine with Tasha K's show, and it was like, damn, bitch, you still got braces. I'm like, bitch, I just got them on two weeks ago. <laughs> 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 so I'll be like responding to shit like that to let a bitch know, yeah, bitch, I got them back again. I, I ain't have them on since then. I, I if you follow me, you will know I had my braces off. They was real cute. My teeth was cute. Now they they started. The partner again. So you had to put So now you're going to start wearing your retainers <laughs> when these come right. on. I'm definitely going to wear my she retainers. You're going to do right you can this get, time. Um, but I like my you braces. You can get permanent retainers. You know that, right? So you don't have to worry and about I got, it. I got permanent retainers on. They still fucked up. I didn't know that happened. That's crazy. Yes. I got on. If you look you behind my teeth. You braces, though. I like braces. Niggas stop it playing. <laughs> my daughter got them. My, my 16 year old. <laughs> it's sexy. Men. Yeah. I, I ain't going to lie. Men, when I got them back on and I show everybody, my DM went crazy. Whoa. That was like, yes. Nah, -uh. yes, Nikki, yes. Wow. It's I remind him of Jada Fire. Well, we mm -hmm. finna wrap Y'all know who Jada Fire is? Mm -hmm. Do y'all know who Jada Fire is? Mm -mm. I don't. Google her when we, when we done. I do know who she Google is. Google right now. She <laughs> I know you know. Yeah, I know. I know exactly so who it is. I'm they say man. we look alike. You look better. Okay. You but look I'm, better, but she, she pretty though. But when she be doing all that, yeah, it's <laughs> hard not to see. Oh, look, uh oh. <laughs> okay, I Thank know. Me later. Oh no, okay. no, no. I already, I already know. You know what I'm talking about. Look, watch. <laughs> yeah, you right. You look better. <laughs> okay, I told you that. <laughs> you do. She pretty though. I like her. Yeah, she she, she fly. <laughs> Stupid. So hey, man, we for the rapper. Did we forget anything? When is your next project? Do you, music wise, when is so music when is wise. I got a dope ass song called A Thousand Kisses. A thousand kisses, kisses from you is never too. Um, ooh, it's fire. Ooh, watch on y'all hear that. When is it coming? coming? It's coming. When I get back to the studio, when I get back to um Atlanta, I'm laying it down. And that's gonna be my TikTok. Cause that's it's gonna like go a, it's crazy. gonna it's like a step to it. Okay. It's it's out of here. When you hear it, it's ready already, it's it's gone. Wow. It's out of here. Yeah, because you've done. been paying so much attention to your acting and everything yes. else that you've just been putting your music to the side. Yes, I just did side. a movie with um, Funny Marco. Mm -hmm. He's supposed to be on here. I like Funny Marco. Amazing. I like him. I love him. He's supposed him. to be on here. So it's a comedy. It's very funny. It's called The Night. Matter of fact, it's uh, Chena has Myron was in, in there. I just was on the phone Marin. with him yesterday. Mm -hmm. I love him. They're my, him. Him. They're my he, brothers. I flew him down. I brought him down here. I had, and cool. When he lost his Instagram, I was hurt. And me I told too. my wife, book the flight. I need that nigga in front yeah, of me. Because yeah. I already did him in Atlanta. Yes. So I was like, I got to get that dude here. That's he, my guy. I, them my brothers. Them yeah. some good ass dudes. That's why right. I bring Marco come, because they friends. Right. So he's like, e. I told him. Bubba Dub was like, I told him too, E. Uh -huh. They love E. Yes. There ain't no games with E. Them some Shout good out to dudes. them niggas. Them yeah. niggas clowned them on niggas here. Them niggas funny as I hell. Introduced, I introduced Bubba Dub to uh, Chinez Miles Chinez on this show. Okay, yes. And them my guys. So just think of Booty Call when you see that movie. You're going to think of Booty Call. Already told me like oh, he is coming. Yeah, it's okay. That movie. So I did not funny. know you was in I it. I'm the, I'm the lead girl. Bro, I'm Marco girl. They told me nothing. I'm, I'm Marco girl. But he probably be here, so I'm gonna give so, him hell of a Uh huh. So in this, you should have seen the kisses scene. <laughs> I was like, hey. no. <laughs> I get it. He couldn't handle that shit. <laughs> 
But how is that? Because then we just had Columbus Short on here, and he was talking about when he Him was Megan on. Good. Cause Megan Good is like, his, like sister. his sister. Okay. So when they were kiss on, he, yeah, he didn't. He was like, it was hard. And life. he was like, it's the hardest thing to kiss her. I think it was hard for Marco too. I, but I didn't. Marco just can't kiss. You taught that nigga something. Yeah, let's I go did. get but it he understood. He got better, huh? Yeah, I got better. He like once we he was. I was like, oh, you ready now? Come on. Hey. <laughs> 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 here come Chin ass Myron. God damn! I hear all the way out here kissing. Oh. Yeah. oh. He ranked on me everywhere we went to eat. The nigga ranked on me. Yes. I can't he rank. said, he 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 "What he say, nigga? You all say rank still? That was <laughs> <laughs> rank, yeah, rank. We say rank too. But nah, that movie gonna be funny as fuck. I can't wait. I oh, can't did you have wait. to read lines for that movie? Huh? Did you have to read lines? And yes, rap? I was the lead, one of the lead females mm -hmm. in um, B. Lynn. This other. Um, How was? Did you like it? Like, let me tell you, that was one of the fun is <laughs> projects I ever been on. Marco, them that man gonna go so far because he's so funny without him and My Myron. They just funny. That dude crazy. They don't do a man. lot it's to be natural. funny. It's so natural. See, yeah. they well, make we, you natural we, around here. We talked about each other the whole time. <laughs> right. I even freestyle with that nigga. I got a freestyle in. Me and him freestyle and he did the 4-4 hey, no, thing. Four, four. Oh, man. We nah, freestyle, but I came with it, nigga. Nah, he's fired. <laughs> but, but funny, Marco, we got to get you on here, nigga. You already know you committed, nigga. Yep. You family now. Free ass down, Marco. <laughs> <laughs> Next stop. <laughs> but hey, man, thank you for coming on the show, man. How can people reach out to you, man? What's your IG? So so my IG is N I K K I Natural. Y'all know how to spell natural, right? <laughs> At Nikki Natural, Twitter, Nikki Natural number one, Facebook. Blue Hefner is not me. I need to put that out there. That bitch Blue. has been impersonating me for the longest. I'm tired of that hoe. Stop it. She's asking people for money and everything. Stop, bitch. Uh -uh. Or nigga, whoever you is. Probably but, nigga. The niggas be doing right. that all the time. She got 5,000 followers on Facebook. But yeah, but. She's growing. <laughs> This old she gonna have this up. You know, girl, she got more so, followers than me. That's wow. crazy. But yeah, so Nikki Natural, I'm here and I'm fucking here to stay. Shout out to Hair Therapy by Dairy, the area, Hook Finn. You know, this she the reason I'm here. You know Dope, what I'm saying? Man, I she love the reason it. I'm here. We gotta shout out her. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Nino, my manager Nino. And you know, we here. I'm here. Motherfucking Dallas, let's get it in. Hey man, don't with a towel man. later. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> you Take it, man. a lot of DMs from some Dallas folks. <laughs> hey man, it's been another great segment. We love you. I love y'all too. It's been another great segment of Boss Talk One Hundred and One, where the bosses talk. And we out.